up YouTube? It's your girl JD Jornay and I am back with another video and as you already saw the title today I'm going to be giving you guys a spring summer type lookbook. The majority of these things y'all have already seen so I'm not going to quite model them. I'm just going to insert the pictures. I just thought that would be easier. I'm definitely going to let you guys know how everything fit and my overall opinions on it. So, if you're new to my channel, please like, comment, subscribe. Also, turn your bell post notifications so you can be notified every time your girl posts a video. And if you're returning, welcome back. We are on the road to 300K. My goal is to hit 300K before my birthday, June 4th. I know we can get it. I know we can do it. I'm actually sick right now, and it's actually killing me because these lights are putting so much heat on me. So, if y'all hear my fan, please try to ignore it. And if my voice sounds a little bit different, please try to ignore it. I'm a little bit under the weather. One minute is hot, one minute is cold, one minute is raining, one minute is sunshine. And my body just does not do well with that type of thing. As always, everything will be linked in the description box below, as well as all of my sites. But yeah, I'm not going to talk y'all heads off. Let's go ahead and get into the video. So I'm going to go ahead and start with one of the outfits that you guys already seen. I got so many questions about this shirt. I got this in a size US 8. And I did cut the sleeves off. So if you could not find this on Pretty Little Things website, it is because I cut the sleeves off and it's not a dress. It was a shirt. So I got this because I wanted to do something super colorful. I, I just, when I go out of town, I love colors. I like to do at least like two looks with a bunch of color in it. So I was like, this would be perfect. Originally, I got the shorts and it, it's a pair of shorts that look exactly like it. I'll put my whole game plan because when I go out of town, I literally make like spreadsheets of my outfits. And so the shorts came, but the shorts were too big. So I did order the shirt too, just in case, because I figured if one don't work, the other one will. And so I ended up going with the shirt because the shorts were too big. This is a size USA. It fits like a normal like button down. It's not too big or not too small. I would say go get your regular size. It, it, it really just depends on if you want to wear it oversized or not. So I would have went down to like a six or a four if I were trying to wear the shirt like very tight fitted. But being that I knew I wanted to wear it kind of more like a dress, I did buy an 8, which is like my regular size. So some yellow from this. And so I got this cute little bag. I got this bag from Amazon. And it kind of looks like those Bottega bags, kind of, sort of, in a way. Um, and I was like, this bag is so nice and classy. And it's actually really good quality, too. I think I paid like $35 for this bag, maybe. I really, really liked this bag. And I paired it with these heels that I got from Sam Edelman. And these are super cute. I literally want every color and they were comfortable too. The only reason why they kind of hurt is because I was walking on gravel and sand. But these shoes are actually really comfortable to be like a heel. And if you look at the heel, the heel is kind of thicker. Like it tapers. It tapers as you get higher, but it's kind of wider at the bottom. So I really, really like this. And I feel like pair all together is super cute. All right. So moving on, I guess we'll cover everything that you guys already seen. So, I actually do not have this outfit. I don't have any idea where it is. This set, I'm going to put pictures right here. And it's just a white two-piece set. It also comes in orange and I think green. And I decided to pull orange from that because I knew that I was going to be wearing those earrings. Things. All of my accessories for, are either from Shein or Amazon. So the bag is from Shein. I thought it was really cute, like a nice little vacation crochet type bag. Those heels are from Lulu's. And that necklace is from Amazon and the earrings are from Shein. And I really built this outfit based on the earrings because I thought the earrings were super duper cute. And I just was like, oh my God, I have to get these. About that outfit, kind of weird trying to tie it, especially like around the hips. And I think I got my irregular size, I can't remember. But you kind of have to show a lot when you're wearing that. So that is one thing that I will be skeptical about. It is stretchy and then the top, it, you don't have to tie the top. The top doesn't come with a tie. But personally, I like to tie because I feel like it gives me more support. So that's what I will say about the outfit. It's literally no support to it. Which was my first night outfit. I am going to be telling y'all about this fit. So this is the shirt that I got. And I loved, loved, loved this shirt. Like, I'm actually going to keep this. Because usually after I wear something and take pictures in it, I'll be like, okay, never see it again. But this is a shirt, like, I feel like I could wear multiple times. It's neutral color. I could style it so many different ways. And I just think it's super duper cute. So I got this in the size USA. 
and it fit perfectly literally perfectly um i did wear boob tape with this shirt so i will say like your whole chest is damn near out you can close it a little bit maybe with pins but i really like this so for the skirt i actually been had that skirt i got that skirt literally like probably like a year ago and it came with a set from shein that i wore with it and i got these shoes off of pretty little thing and guess how much i paid for them 15 dollars so this was literally a steal i think these shoes are super duper cute they like little barbie doll shoes i think they're adorable um and they're kind of shiny sparkly that's really what made me gravitate towards them so i really really like these most of my accessories are from shein i seen this bracelet i saw that this blue really matched the skirt and i was like okay i don't want to do the blue shirt but I can definitely pair it with another shirt. And so I seen like this beige color and I was like, okay, that that's kind of how we can get this look together. And then I paired it with this pink purse that I got from Shein. And I feel like it just came together so well. It was so cute. And yeah. So the next thing that I was super excited about was my bikini picture. I really want to take a really cute like swimsuit picture. Here are the slides that I want to wear. And these slides went with the hat so well again. Y'all, I unpacked, but I don't know where nothing is at. That's why I should have did this before I left. But it was just a time thing. I didn't have time to do it. So these slides went really good with the hat. I'll insert a picture of the hat. The hat had blue, red, brown, green, all these different colors in it. And I was like, I'm going to do a colorful type look. And I had a yellow swimsuit and this yellow bag. The yellow swimsuit and the yellow bag were both from Shein. These were from Pretty Little Thing. What I will say about buying swimsuits from Shein, which I will probably end up never buying a swimsuit from Shein again, because they're so small up top. Like if you have chest, this swimsuit is literally not going to fit you. So don't even try, cause it was just a headache. And I literally like, if y'all, I know y'all probably could tell in the pictures, but in real life like my boobs were like i had to literally cover it like i could not wear that swimsuit to the beach that's why i knew i had to only take it pictures at the house because i could not go nowhere like that with my boobs spilling out my booty out like no nah, heck no nah. so that's what i would say about shein for anybody that's thicker or any voluptuous uh, voluptuous to them you cannot wear their baby swimsuits it's just not given okay so my camera is acting stupid i just had to change sd cards batteries so let's hope that now everything is how it needs to be so moving on i'm about to go to some of the outfits that i packed but i did not end up wearing this cosmo and wanda moment so pink and green are very very nice with each other i think those two correlate very well so i know i want to do something with pink and green but i wanted to do it something with a little pop and so originally i got this dress actually this was not the dress that i was the skirt that i was supposed to be wearing i was supposed to wear a shorter skirt but i just had so many problems with the skirt i bought two of them then they was just it was a lot i got this dress but i just folded it down into a skirt for the lookbook and it is a size us 10 so my size and then this shirt this hot pink little tie shirt was also a cute little moment and i got this in a size us 12 because your girl got boobs so i had to get really like anything that's tie like bikinis and stuff like that tops i literally get 12s 14s whatever is gonna give me more fabric with this green bag and i just saw this bag on ego and i just thought it was super duper cute and sparkly i'm really not crazy about green but i just think that this bag is just so perfect it's a little tiny bag and is it not the cutest like what can't fit much in there you can fit your credit cards probably some lip gloss definitely not your keys or your phone but it's still cute and it kind of gives that pop of like that metallic green i actually have these shoes in pink as well now i won't say that they're the best quality because they did break on my birthday but i was stuffing in the club so i don't know maybe maybe they're good quality maybe you just can't do too much but i thought these heels were super cute and fun i love the heel and so i paired it with them but i thought this look all overall came together you can pair it so many different ways you can make it be all pink you can wear all pink dress pair it with the green that's what originally i had but when i seen the zebra i was like okay the zebra can give too all right so moving on i have my next outfit and this was like my only neutral outfit i do like to wear neutral colors too on vacation it just gives sophisticated and it just gives nice and calm so i have this skirt that i got from fashion nova 
super duper cute or whatever and it just has like this little crochet skirt and i paired it with this bodysuit that i have on right now and then i paired it with these heels that i got focus and i just thought the heel was really cool i like how it has like the circles and it's kind of like bamboo looking and i thought it would go perfect with this purse i actually stole this purse from my mom so i don't know where she got it from but don't it go so perfectly with these shoes and so i was like i do want to do like a brown little natural look because i think that'd be really cute so i paired this together and it came along really well everything fit nicely i did get that skirt in a size small i got the skirt in a size small and it was still a little bit like loose at the waist so i did have to tie it so i will say go down a size in this skirt if you do purchase it but this look came together really well and i think it does really, really look cute with how my hair is today too like the brown the blonde struggling with the last outfit and it's crazy because we didn't even end up going nowhere the last night but <sighs> i just bought this dress and i think it's cute i would definitely wear this dress with boob tape don't wear a bra like i did in the try on um i would definitely wear this with boob tape if i were to wear this because it's just it would look better a bra it's, it's a halter neck that would not look good but i ain't gonna lie i'm sick right now and i just did not feel like doing all that putting all the accessories on taking them off so i was like ciao here yeah i got this dress in a size us eight and it literally fit perfectly this is a more classy type loose fitted dress more flowy it definitely gives vacation but i thought this was really really cute too i paired it with these pink heels that i already had and i just adore these heels so much they're so comfortable and yet so cute i got these a long time ago from pretty little thing i wore these to puerto rico last year so i've been had these and then i paired it with this purse it's a pretty little thing purse so yeah that is the last and final outfit everything that i didn't get to wear i'm debating on if i'm gonna keep it if i'm gonna not keep it it's probably too late to take it back but most of that i'm probably gonna end up keeping because i'm gonna end up traveling sometime some way so might as well not go through the hassle of having to send it back um i really did enjoy my trip to mexico i really have fun picking out outfits and looking for stuff to wear that's something that i find a lot of joy in not looking per se but once i have the outfits i really like feel accomplished <laughs> but yes hope your girl get back feel back better it seemed like i'm always coming on here telling y'all that i'm sick it's always it's i'm always coughing i'm always sneezing i'm always nose running it's like once a month i get some type of cold it's like my body what are you trying to tell me like what's up like it's irritating at this point because i just be wanting to live a functional regular life and it's like my energy be gone i literally lay in the bed all day yesterday like i got up put my wig cap on and literally laid down to like seven o'clock and then got up and finished my hair like that's not normal i need to like i be taking my vitamins my vitamin c all that and i still be getting sick i don't understand so that's neither here nor there but thank you all for watching also i told you guys i want to show you guys what i do and this helps me so if you are ever thinking about planning outfits for your trip which i strongly advise you to pre-plan create these little, create these little layouts and literally label them and that's why an itinerary is always so important so you can know exactly what you're doing so you can know how to pack and what to bring you guys take something away from that but that was it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed remember that everything will be linked down below also my size and stuff like that will be down there so you guys can kind of gauge my weight my height all that is down there so you guys can kind of figure out if we're similar in size or if we are not you can kind of know how things run i hope you guys enjoyed this video i love you all and i will see you guys in the next freaking video